What is up, Official Bean Nation? Watts here, and today you are going to be viewing one of the best comebacks that I have ever personally been a part of on Black Ops 2. And I enjoyed playing this game. First round, I went 6-1. and one. I jump in with a little bit over two minutes to go in the first round. At the end of the first round, um, we are down 104 to like 61 or something like that. I'm not exactly sure, so don't hold me to those numbers. Second round, I go 24 and 9, and we get the W. We come back, get the W, playing the objective. Fuck the KD. Uh, I do finish 30 and 10. Some people may not find that impressive. I really don't care. Uh, I am not a pub stomper. I have, I have never claimed to be a pub stomper. I have never claimed to be a good COD player. I am the average COD player. Um, I play COD for for fun. You know, I I do not base my life on any kind of achievement on Call of Duty. I don't base this shit on my KD. But uh, anyways, normally guys, I do my strip club stories for OBN, but today I want to talk to you about something totally different, and I want to talk to you about YouTube and the game that you play on YouTube, okay? People see these big YouTubers like Woody's Gamertag, and, and they see that you can make a living off of YouTube. Um, there are a lot of big youtubers that all they do is they make videos they post these videos and they get paid for them well because of that you have a lot of people who think you know I can make a video and I'll blow up and I will be making money like Woody's Gamertag and I don't have to get a real job I do YouTube for fun I am not partnered with anybody um, and even if I was partnered with anybody I wouldn't be making a lot of money because I don't have hundreds of thousands of subscribers you know I don't get 10 to 30 thousand views a video um, so I don't think that way but you have a lot of people that think that they're actually going to make a living doing YouTube so because of that they try to do whatever they can to grow their channel to get views and whatnot I am one of those people I'm not a dishonest person uh, I hate people who are dishonest okay I recently was thinking about starting my own community channel in the hopes of being able to help other people like Brady has helped me with Official Bean Nation. Um, I talked to Brady about it and I, after explaining to Brady what I wanted to do, you know, Brady said that he would be willing to help me. Well, I informed one of the other former members of Official Bean Nation, uh, Mr. Blaze or Warden, I, don't, I forgot what the name he was using when he uploaded to OBN. And, you know, Blaze tried to start drama between me and Brady, you know, and I had told him that I had already talked to Brady about it. So he goes and tells Brady that I am trying to steal directors from OBN, that I said that I would run a better channel than Brady. And, you know, this is something that I never said. So Brady, of course, after we had had the to talk about it already, Brady comes to me and he's like, you know, Blaze is saying this and I cannot believe I just missed that guy. But anyways, you know, Blaze was saying this, and so I decided, well, you know, we should troll Blaze. So that's what we do. Um, and the whole time that we're trolling Blaze, Blaze is, like, trying to start drama. Um, Blaze thinks that I want him to come and be a part of my new community channel. So he starts trying to recruit and steal directors from OBN. Um, with that being said, finally, after the troll was over... I joined back into OBN and I'm like just saying how much I love Brady, how much I love OBN and he realizes he's been trolled and you know finally we decided to kick him from OBN or Brady decided to kick him from OBN, my apologies. Uh, but it's just something that I think you need to watch out for if you are starting on YouTube. Don't be that guy first off. Don't be the guy who tries to use people and tries to take advantage of people who are trying to help him. I actually posted one of Blaze's videos on my subscriber Sundays and he actually picked up some subs because of it. I feel now I feel bad for all those people that who subscribe to him um, because I'm the one that introduced Blaze to them. Um, so you know, and normally whenever somebody joins OBN, I'm very distant to that person. You know, I'm not rude to them, but I am not one of those people that is like, you know, oh yeah, cool, link me your channel so I can subscribe. I just don't do that because I want to make sure that the reasons you're joining OBN um, are legit reasons. Like you really just want to grow your channel and you want to be a part of something 
other than yourself. Um, that is why I'm a part of OBN. You know, I feel like it is a, a good thing. It's a way to grow. It's a way to network with other YouTubers. I've met a lot of people because of OBN. Um, and I've grown my channel because of OBN. And like a lot of the success I have had with growing my channel has, in my opinion, has really nothing to do with me. It has more to do with um, OBN and Brady and some of the connections I've been able to build because of that. So the message, guys, that I have for you is to be careful with YouTube. Okay, Don't necessarily distrust everyone. But don't put your full faith into somebody that you meet on YouTube. Not everybody on YouTube is here to help you. Not everybody on YouTube wants, has your best interests at heart. Um, all I know is that if you are looking for a community channel to join, Official B Nation is a good community channel to join. Brady will do whatever he can to help you. The other members of OBN will do whatever they can to help you because that's just the kind of people they are, you know? That's the kind of people that I that we are. You know, that's the kind of person that I am. I will do whatever I can to help anybody else as long as I feel like they're not trying to take advantage of me and trying to take advantage of my kindness, you know? Um and that's that's it's like the old saying goes, don't mistake my kindness for weakness. Um but that is the message guys don't use people don't trust everybody because some people are going to contact you because they want your help because they're going to try to find a way to take advantage of the relationship whether it be forming a collab channel and picking up subs and you know like I said, I normally try to help as many people as I can, but whenever somebody with like 20 subs hits me up and says, oh, you know, well, could you sub to my channel and like some of my videos, I don't do it, you know, just because don't, don't ask me to sub to your channel, you know, if I enjoy your channel, I will sub to your channel, I don't need, um, I don't need you to ask me to do anything, you know, um, and if you do a join official Bean Nation, guys, which I, like I said, is something I recommend don't start spamming your your videos right away you know wait until you post a couple videos to a community channel before you start spamming your videos to the other guys uh, but anyways guys I hope you enjoyed this commentary and the next video I upload for OBN will be a strip club story anyways guys peace out deuces I love you guys I love Brady I love OBN see y'all later the pictures are the bonds upon a clearer paint the nomads, the savages, the warriors emotion.